One night as I sat in me window, oh, a letter man came unto me, and he brought me a fine invitation, inviting myself round to tea. I could tell it was hooligan scented, but I went there for old friendship's sake. Ah, the thing that they gave me to tackle was Mrs. Hooligan's Christmas cake. There were plums and prunes and berries, raisins, currants and cinnamon too. There were nuts and cloves and cherries, but the top it was stuck on with glue. There were caraway seeds in abundance, would give you a fine toothache. It would kill a man twice to be eating a slice of Mrs. Hooligan's Christmas cake. Mulligan wanted to try it, but really it was no use. She worked at it for nearly an hour and couldn't pry anything loose. Mulligan went for the hatchet and Hooligan went for the saw But in attempting to smash it They broke the hatchet and Mulligan's left jaw There were plums and prunes and berries Raisins and currants and cinnamon too There were nuts and cloves and cherries but the top it was stuck on with glue. There were caraway seeds in abundance. It would give you a fine toothache. And it would kill a man twice to be eating a slice of Mrs. Hooligan's Christmas cake. A little man who worked in the army. A soldier or some such like. He come in with a small box of matches and a big stick of red gel ignite. We retired five paces, maybe seven, and we watched as the fuse flame raced. Well, the house rose upwards to heaven, but the confection remained in its place. There were plums and prunes and berries, Raisins, currants and cinnamon too There were nuts and cloves and cherries But the top it was stuck on with glue There were caraway seeds in abundance To it give you a fine toothache ah, It would kill a man twice To be eaten a slice of Mrs. Hooligan's Christmas cake